joining me at Mecham Auto Auctions in Houston, Texas. You know, I always tell my friends, you can, no matter what kind of car you're looking for, you can always find it at a Mecham Auto Auction. Whether it's a hot rod or a classic or a custom, a European sports car, a modern late model Mercedes, all the way back to an early 1900 Mercedes, you can find it here. And as living proof of that, look what we came across as we were walking around the cars today. Yes, it's none other than the Batmobile. And uh, this replica Batmobile is built on a 1989 Corvette chassis. So it's got four wheel brakes, but what they did is they put a whole tube chassis around it. It's got individual airbag suspension at each corner, so it'll handle as well. But the coolest thing about it, and the feature that I like the most, is it's got dual retractable and deployable 30 caliber Browning machine guns, just like the movie car, that come out of the store and these fire blanks. So what they've done to make it legal is they've removed the receiver from the Browning machine guns, operated out of propane, and it fires blanks, 30 caliber blanks, out of both sides of the car. And I mean, how cool would that be? I mean, you would absolutely be the hit of the neighborhood or everyone in the neighborhood would hate you uh, for being able to drive down the street and fire these uh, 30 caliber Browning machine guns. The canopy is just super cool and it's remote control. So you hit a button, the canopy slides forward so you can get in the vehicle. And once you're in the vehicle, you can click the button and the canopy will slide back. Uh, it's currently powered uh, by the 89 Corvette small block Chevrolet, but they built it so it'll also accept a Viper V10 engine. So if you want to add some naturally aspirated horsepower, you can uh, put the Viper V10 engine in it. But what the builder also did was he made it so it actually accept a Boeing turbine engine. So yes, you can have a real Boeing turbine engine in here with those intakes and the exhaust that uh, is out the back but just take a look at that those fins just like the movie car uh, they've done a, a good job of uh, uh, doing this recreation it's got cameras mounted in the rear here so you can uh, so you can see what's going on behind you because obviously it doesn't have a, a rear window uh, an interesting thing that the uh, builder did was he actually put a receiver for a trailer hitch and uh, the wiring harness for it as well. I don't exactly know what you would trailer behind the Batmobile, but hey, if you uh, want to trailer something, uh, you're able to do that. So, But all the DOT lights, uh, of course, in it. And, uh, you know, I got to tell you, if it were me, I mean, I just put on a Batman costume once a month and, and go driving around. I, I think you'd have a blast uh, doing that. But uh, awesome looking car. We're gonna keep spinning around it so you can take a look at it uh, in 360 degrees. Of course, the car is not for everybody, but uh, if you're a Batman craze, I, I think it'd be a, a pretty cool car to put in your collection. Or like I said, to be able to, to just drive it around. So there you have it. Uh, as we said, you can get anything uh, from Mecham Auto Auctions. Of course, this vehicle you won't be able to find on Haggerty's valuation tool at haggerty.com or on your app. I'm pretty sure they don't have a good valuation for a Batmobile. But what they did just add to that Haggerty valuation tool is the is the ability to get data on both trucks and SUVs. And as you know, trucks and SUVs super hot right now. There's tons of them here at the auction. That's uh, Those have been included on that Haggerty valuation tool so you'll be able to accurately look at those valuations as the cars come up on the block. So go to Haggerty.com to check that out. And of course, CokerTire.com to uh, order your wheels and tires. But uh, hey, thanks again for being here. Uh, you can watch this on Mecham.com live stream or NBCSN. In fact, tomorrow on NBCSN, I'll be doing a cool little segment on a Harley board track racer with sidecar. It's a, a cool little piece, and uh, Stephen Cox and I will be talking about that tomorrow. So see you then.